the first Miss Universe in 1952 and the Miss International in 1960 actually belongs to the Philippines legally. Armi Kusela of Finland in 1952 won the first Miss Universe and married to a Filipino businessman, Virgilio Hilario. And in 1960, Colombian beauty queen Stella Marquez have won the first Miss International. And again, she married a rich Filipino guy, George Araneta. The first time Virgilio saw Army Cusela, he was completely had fallen in love. He was head over heels over Army Cusela. He would follow him to, to her previous assignments in Japan, Hong Kong, and a year later, three carat diamond ring was given to Army Cusela, and she cannot refuse anymore. They got married. Army and Gil, they call him Gil now, they have made quite a few movies, and some of them were actually made in Finland. So both of them were quite popular in the early 50s. And that we have to remember that was just after World War II. Every gold does not exist anymore. They have filed bankruptcy a couple of years ago. Army and Gail have five children. And unfortunately, at the age of 57, Gil had suffered a heart attack and he died. And he left the Gilarmi Corporation to Army Kusela. But now Army Kusela is 88 years old and she is living in San Diego, California. She was doing some community work and also fundraising for the disadvantaged people in San Diego. And we can look at our first Miss International by marriage, which is Stella Marquez Araneta. She was only 23 years old when she won the pageant in Long Beach, California. 52 contestants she beat out on that particular event. Miss International was actually owned by Miss International Japan. And a year after winning the event, she was invited to the Philippines to see one of the fashion shows held in Araneta Coliseum. And this is where she met George. George fell head over heels to Stella Marquez Araneta. And three years later, it ended up into a marriage. George was flying back and forth from the Philippines to Colombia to win the heart of Stella Marquez. And in 1973, Stella Marquez was given Filipino citizenship and she stayed to the Philippines up until now. I heard on one of her comments that she would support the Philippines versus her own regional country. Estela Marquez has been holding the position of a national director of Bini Bining Pilipinas. But there was a controversy in one of the year when MJ Lastimosa won Miss Universe Philippines. She was being blamed for her losing the event because of the costume and the gown 
that she used for the event was not up to up to the measure or to the scale of Miss Universe. And the year P awards back and Adriana from Colombia was head to head to win Miss Universe title. Steve Harvey, of course, made a mistake in announcing Adriana, but actually a few minutes later, it was taken back and given to Pia. And while Estela Marquez was the national director, the Philippines did very well, having six Miss International plus one Estela Marquez is seven. And we have four official Miss Universe plus one by marriage, Army Kusela. That is a very good record for the Philippines. Thank you for watching and please hit the subscribe button below.